hey guys welcome back to my channel for another video if you are new here welcome if you're a returning subscriber welcome back so guys in today's video i will be making this scalp treatment for dry scalp dandruff that's going to help with your hair to grow your hair long healthy and strong so stay tuned for the video Now guys, I will be using the oil that I made in my previous video and this is the aloe vera and clove oil. If you haven't seen this video, I will leave it up above for you guys so that you guys can check it out because you need to make this oil to move to the next step. In this treatment, I will be adding glycerin. Glycerin is amazing for the scalp and for the hair. I will go into some of the benefits and also green tea extra. We'll also be adding some water to this as well. If you do not have any green tea extract, you can use a green tea bag. Just make it with some um, hot water and leave it to soak until it's cool. And then you use that instead if you do not have green tea extract. So we're just going to combine all the ingredients together, guys. You know how it is on this channel the recipes are very simple we are not overdoing it because you don't have to overdo it to get maximum benefits with these ingredients so guys you just mix all the ingredients together you can you don't have to add any essential oil to this because the essential oil was added to the aloe vera and clove oil so you need to check that video out to make that oil so you can make this treatment for your scalp now the reason why i decide to make this treatment is because my scalp is very dry because i have not washed my hair for three weeks so if you have dry scalp guys or product build up on your scalp definitely after three weeks you're gonna have some product build up you're gonna have some dry scalp going on so you want to go in with a scalp treatment pre poo to soften up those product build up and dry scalp that is on your scalp the reason why you need to actually go in with a pre poo for your scalp guys is because the fact that the scalp is dry you cannot go and use a shampoo right away to wash your hair because that's not going to get all the product buildup or dandruff off your scalp a lot of times you might be washing your hair and at the end of the wash day there's a lot of white stuff on your scalp still it seems as if your scalp did not get clean this is because you need to pre poo your scalp before you go in with the shampoo so one of the main reason why i decide to add glycerin to this is because glycerin is great for the scalp because it's going to help to minimize or even eliminate the dandruff and itchy scalp dry scalp that you might be experiencing glycerin can also help to strengthen the hair so who doesn't like stronger hair because stronger hair is going to lead out to longer hair green tea is also another ingredient that is great for dandruff it is scalp dry scalp but my main reason for adding this to the recipe is because green tea helps with shedding Green tea is a natural DHT blocker, so if you are someone that is experiencing shedding, this is great to use. This is an overall amazing ingredient to use on your scalp because it's going to help with so many different things that is going on with your scalp. And a lot of times we have shedding issues, so this is a great natural ingredient to help to stop your hair from shedding out. So when you soften the scalp, guys, this is going to have great benefits for the hair soften your scalp this is mean is you're going to help to unclog your the pores on your scalp this is going to give way to nourishing follicles and you know when the follicles are nourished they start to produce longer hair growth right so all the nutrients that you're going to add to your hair on wash day your deep conditioning treatment um whatever treatment you're going to add your hair mask all those nutrients will be able to receive better on your scalp when your scalp is clean so this is why pre-pooing your scalp 
um, for the first part of your wash day, go in, soften up your scalp, and then you go in with your shampoo and get the product buildup or dandruff of your scalp. Then you continue to go in with your regular wash day. And also guys, when you are adding these treatments to your scalp, you need to go in and massage your scalp as well. So that is going to help with blood circulation in the scalp. So when the blood is circulating through the scalp, this is going to promote and push oxygen to the hair follicles. And then you're going to have nourished follicles again. So it's a win-win situation when you're adding pre-poo to your scalp and especially if this pre-poo contains ingredients that is going to promote healthier hair growth so guys don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you have not already subscribed and i will see you guys in my next one bye guys